It was a blissful family break, which soon turned into a holiday disaster. My husband and I were walking around with my son. All of a sudden, his knees buckled and he just started screaming bloody murder. The sand was incredibly, incredibly hot. And so my husband got um, a shovel or something to, or one of the spades to have a look and it, it turned out that there was a, a barbecue under there. Stephanie rushed Harry into the sea and held his feet in the water. Shortly afterwards, he was taken to hospital with second degree burns. He's got an enormous blister that goes along half the length of his foot. And on his left foot, he's just got um, lots of little blisters on there as well. It was awful. It was really, really awful. I, I think you feel helpless. It was just so, so distressing. I, I can't begin to explain how how piercing and gut-wrenching these screams and cries were. Like, I mean, you hear kids cry all the, all the time, you know, on the beach when they fall over or whatever, but this was, it honestly was one of the worst things I've, I've ever experienced. It was, it was just awful. It's really, really, really sad. And it still obviously makes me, um, makes me quite upset now. Well, this is the beach where young Harry and his family were enjoying their day out. And you can see that if there were a hot barbecue buried under the sand here, you wouldn't know about it until it was too late. The local council say they want to crack down on irresponsible beachgoers, putting everyone at risk. We're putting out messages on social media, using adverts, press coverage, to uh, tell people of the dangers of disposing of barbecues inappropriately. We have got bins along the beach for them to store them. I would think it would be almost impossible to ban them. I would like to, but then there's other machines that they would bring onto the beach that might be even worse appropriate. Uh, they might be taking barbecues onto scrubland and then uh, there'd be uh, fires. I do apologise on behalf of the council that uh, the lad got um, uh, his feet burnt. Um, it's very unfortunate and we do everything in our power to uh, stop this sort of thing.